<laughs> so when does it become so bad that it's good? Is the gobbledygooker another case of it's so bad it's good? Or was it just so bad? And you know, when it's so hot, so long, well, that means that the incubation is all over. In the 1990 Survivor Series, there was a giant egg, and there was speculation on what is going to come out of this giant egg. Was it going to be the debut of Ric Flair in the WWE? That's what everybody thought was going to happen. But when you think about it, why would Ric Flair come out of an egg? A giant egg. This is a case of what Vince McMahon thinks is funny, is funny, right? If Vince McMahon says that, yes, we're going to have a gobbledygooker come out of an egg, it's going to happen. And it did. And this is a case of one of those things where Vince thought it was funny and everybody else hated it. Now, I think the gobbledygooker was a dumb idea. I think the surprise of what's going to come out of an egg, was it going to be a Playboy Playmate, a former world champion? What was it going to be, right? The one thing that nobody expected was the gobbledygooker. Honestly, I will say the gobbledygooker is one of the least favorite things in all of professional wrestling. It didn't go anywhere. Nothing came of it. He danced with Mean Gene, and that was it. Now, the gobbledygooker did return at WrestleMania 17 in the gimmick Battle Royal, which was funny. And then he returned a few other times, but nothing notable. The gobbledygooker was just a big, huge, elaborate plan to get people to tune into the Survivor Series pay-per-view. I mean, WWE was at a cartoony time at that time, but even having a giant gobbledygooker come out of an egg was a dumb idea. It wasn't anything that I liked. I don't know anyone, I don't know what one person liked it besides Vince McMahon. Anyway guys, let me know what you think of the gobbledygooker in the comment section below. Was this a gimmick that was so bad it's good, or was it just so bad? Anyway, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. We'll be back with more Wrestlers Scared Stupid. Agile sucker, huh, for a bird? Oh, there goes me, Gene. He's agile too, but a little bottom heavy. <laughs> Something's just on fire. Up and down.